what's going on everybody so man based on my last video a lot of people felt like i hadn't spent enough time with the vision pro and that some people even said i was being biased so like i said in my original video i mean i used this thing for about 30 minutes at the apple store but what i decided to do was hey just to go ahead and pick one up and i'm just going to rightfully compare them and try to give people more insight from an like i said an unbiased perspective i'm somebody who you know loves technology i love cameras i love figuring out how things can be useful or if they're not useful at all. With that being said, I picked this thing up and I'm going to be comparing it. Right now, we're looking at the pass-through mode. So I think this is one of the most popular features from this device, from the Quest, from any VR device. The pass-through is kind of the thing that has people hyped. It's being able to see things like this without it actually being there. So yeah, we're definitely going to do a video. Well, I'm definitely going to do more videos about this device um, I just picked it up earlier today and let me just give y'all kind of like a quick preview of like going on the internet Now let's see let's go to like Yahoo So number one look you can make the screen pretty much I want to say this is like 70 Inch screen. I'm not even sure you can make it as big as that or you can make it literally small You can even do like phone style. It's kind of up to you um, If you want to move it around you just look there. So this is probably like one of the I guess biggest features that's kind of why i'm doing it as you pull it closer it's like that pull it down it's more flat everybody has their own viewing style um you know one of the things i like about it off the gate let's take this um this travis kelsey taylor swift so i'm looking at it right one second oh sorry about that you see how you can like look and zoom now that's one of the things i noticed even when i did the demo i feel like you can definitely zoom closer on this thing compared to uh, the meta quest so that's pretty cool um look we got tyler perry over there let me show you easy just a quick click a link so i'm looking at the tyler perry and boom i just clicked on there you know so boom that's that right there right now when it passed through let me go ahead and just show you the immersive mode really quick you see how that thing comes up basically just twist it around now what i do like about immersive mode is like when you switch to this you hear the sound it's like a very subtle sound. I want to say you could turn it off and on, but that's pretty cool. But I prefer the pass-through mode of any VR device. I think that's pretty cool. And like I said, I haven't really put any apps. I haven't really done anything on here. I'm just doing a quick demo. Let's look at the iTunes store. So as you can see, I'm already signed into my account. Let's browse. As a matter of fact, look at my library. Let's see what's on here. Okay, so boom, you got oh, got a couple music videos. Crazy thing is I bought all these in 2008. Now, as somebody pointed out in the last video, one of the best things about all Apple products is the fact that they sync up and are connected. That is always going to be one of the best things. For example, let's watch this music video. <laughs> Wait a minute, I don't know why is that doing it but okay let's try michael jackson really quick okay so this must be something where it like doesn't allow it to be played now you can't zoom in on here but you know it looks cool so let's look at the albums really quick yeah this is just some of my library so yeah i just want to show this really quick and i want to do a browse the app store really quick so apparently there's over uh don't allow apparently there's over a thousand apps already available on here now i don't know if all of these apps are you know specifically designed well i don't want to say designed for vision pro a lot of them are probably just like ports so i don't know how many ones specific for vision pro are actually out but a lot of the ports are on here so that is cool and this works the same way look if you want to take this and move it around or even make it you know bigger and apparently, let's see, I think I made it too big. But yeah, I just want to do a quick demo. Hey, so expect plenty more videos. Like I said, I just want to show people, um, you know, kind of what it does. Well, not really what it does, but I'm like, so I'm going to compare it to the Quest 3. And I'm also just going to give people that in-depth kind of look from a non-biased perspective. I said, hey, you know, we got the Quest 3. Got a couple devices in the studio, but now we're going to talk about the Vision Pro. Everybody wants to learn more about it. So whatever you want to know about this device, go ahead and drop a comment. I'll drop plenty more videos. In the meantime, peace. Now let's see if we can end this video. Let's see. You look up. Well, there it goes. I had the little find a little green thing.